This is the Douglas Drive Creek Crossing, located in the C.P. Painesville sub in, in uh, Crystal, Minnesota. Here we have two new, new gated cantilevers, each with LED lights and each with an e -bell. This is an overview looking north, located at the southern signal. On the overhead lights, you've got 12 by 24 inch G uniform local LEDs and safe turn frames. Also, a safe turn junction box. Side lights, we got G, we got 12 by 24 inch G uniform, G uniform LEDs and safe pin frames. As well as Safe turn junction box. Side view of lights. I mean, I mean that side view. I mean side view of the main lights of the, open, of the, open, of the, of the side lights. And and, and, 12, and and on the main lights we got 12 by 24 inch G uniform LEDs and safe turn frames. This is a Siemens cantilever. Side lights and side and side view of the overhead lights. And side view of the main lights. And this one has a safe turn junction box in the back of the cantilever. The gate the gate mass is, is from Siemens. This has a Siemens gate mechanism. Side view of the back lights with a safe turn junction box. Back view of lights. He here has the door shutting of four through LEDs, as well as a GS3 E bell up top. There's a back view of the main of the overhead lights and a back view of the southern signal. The green here is all concrete. Here's the relay bundle in the southwest quadrant. Traffic facing west towards Plymouth, Medina, Rockford. You facing east at West Broadway and towards Minneapolis and the BSF sta Staples Sub. These signals were installed in, in early 2017, replacing a pair of farming cantilevers. These and it, and, and it had a safety mechanical bell on, on top of it, and it had Harman fading LEDs on each cantilever. And it used to have the, the blue DOT signs on the cali on the on the mast pole of the cantilever instead of the gate mast. And there, there and there was no cross bucks on the oh, on the cantilever part. It's kind of interesting. But these crossings have been replaced during a horn zone instead of a quiet zone, so, yeah, originally these were, um, these used to have, uh, horn zone, but now it's just a quiet zone, so yeah. Here's an overview of the, now looking south, we look here at the southern signal, I mean northern signal, sorry about that. On the overhead lights, we got 12 by 24 inch GE uniform built LEDs and safe turn frames as well as a safe turn junction box. Main lights, we got 12 by 24 inch GE uniform built LEDs and safe turn frames. We forgot to point out the dot number. Dot number is 688-953-S. Siemens, another 
Mr. Siemens Calliver. Here's a, this is a, this, this has, this, the gate mass is from Siemens. Back, on the back side, we've got a safe transjunction box on the back side of the cantilever. This is, this is a seam, so we have another Siemens gate mechanism. Side view the back lens with a safe transjunction box. Back view the main lights. Key here has a newer stripping with four and three LEDs, as well as a GS3 E bell. Top of the mass pole, the caliber. Back view of the overhead lights, and here's the back view of the southern caliber. I mean, northern caliber. All right, so this has been the Douglas Drive Grade Crossing.